Hey y'all, we're hey. gonna get ready to do a cute little craft with us because it's gonna be amazing. It's gonna be something that you're gonna be able to use outside, but yes. also it's gonna make you think about love Yes. and how valuable you are. Yes. You are so valuable to the Lord and we just want to reach out and let you know that. Never yes. think you're worthless no. because God doesn't think that. No. I'm Vonda. This is Paula. Hey. And we're crafting with scripture. Yes. So today we are going to make a bird feeder. Yes. I, I kind of feel like I'm back in Girl Scout times. I know. Again. I know. I'm the Girl Scout kind of leader now. and y'all yeah. are all my Girl Scouts. That's right. A few Boy Scouts out there, that's okay. Yes. So we're the going Scouts. to be elbow yes. deep in peanut butter <laughs> and bird seed. And bird seed. <laughs> well, and bird food. Okay. Yes. So we got a big old bag of yes. bird seed. Paula got a deal. I did. Thanks to the guys at Home Depot. Yes. Thanks, guys. The bag had been busted. Yes. So they knocked it down. Yep. Once they found out, y'all, that y'all were going to be watching. I know. They were excited. They were excited. I told so, them we're going to use it for crafting. Yes. Yes. Yeah. So hats off to yes. Home Depot. Yes. And so we've got several different kinds of bird seed here. Yes. We've got the big sunflower seeds. Yes. Right there. Like this. I cardinals love these things, yes. I know. We've yes. got pumpkin seed. Pumpkin seed, yep. We've got that tiny little stuff that I don't know what it's called, yeah. but it's on all, all bird seed. It has almost it. looks like little um little tiny pearls. Teeny weeny little teeny weeny pearly weeny. stuff. And yeah. then you just, guys know what it is. Write in the comments and tell us. Yeah, <laughs> tell us what it is, because I don't know. It's yeah. always in the bird seed and it's always the tiny yeah. stuff. Yeah. And this might be do you know what this one is? No, I don't. I know it's bird seed. Yeah, it's some kind of bird seed. Some kind of bird That's seed. That's what we know. Okay. Yeah. So we also have some Cheerios. Yes. Because who doesn't love Cheerios? Birds love Cheerios. That's right. Yeah. And it is blackberry season again. <gasps> yes. We're a little early, but we thought to add a little extra color, some we've color. got red and ones. And birds love ones. And black ones. Bonda picked them out. I did. Here now, place. I have to admit, I did eat a few of them. That's okay. But I did leave them for the birds. Yes, but you did. Yes. If you're going to go to the trouble to have it on yeah. your hands, you might as well at least eat one of and them, right? these are split peas. We know that birds will eat those too. Yeah. Yeah. And then there's like a variety of other little different seeds that were in the bird seed bag that we know they'll love. Yeah. So, yeah. So, just check it out at your local store. Yeah. And just, just grab a whole bunch of them. Yeah. So the first thing that we're going to do, we are going to nail this to a tree. Yes. Um, we thought about hanging it, but I'm kind mm -hmm. of afraid that if we don't and we just hang it down there, then It'll flop around the wind's going to yeah. get it. Yeah. yeah. Make our birds yeah. sick. So it's this is going to be a really, really fun, easy, cheap, inexpensive, whichever yeah. word you want to use. Um, craft project because so you just can take, do it with your kids. Yeah, the kids will love to do this. Yeah. So you just start with um, a nine inch aluminum foil pan. That's it. Now, yeah. this one was one of those that I got at the Dollar Tree. I got mm -hmm. three of them for a right. dollar, and um, we were able to um, get three for a dollar, so that's 33 cents. Yeah. But these were the kind that you get like at a restaurant where you can yeah. take it. Hey, a doggy like, bag. For like, doggy bag? Yeah, for like to go. Um, to, go. to go. Leftovers? Yeah. To go? Yeah. Yeah. So it has a deep, deep um, side on it, if you guys can see that. Yep. I like the deep side mm -hmm. because I think, I just see little birds perching, perching right there. Perching on the side. Yeah. yeah. So first thing we're going to do is poke a hole. Right. So that when with, we get it loaded up. Yep, with a nail. You're just going to take a big nail. That's yep. screw. But, oh, yeah. just don't tell Paula. <laughs> I know. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> okay, so we're going to turn it around like this, and we're just going to bore a little hole in there because yes. we want it to be able to be there so that all we have to do when we get ready to put it on the tree is right. just hang it on there. So, Vonda, so, do we want it at the very edge, or we oh, want no, it a little we bit want down? It, we want it a little bit down. Okay, so we're just going to... There we go. That is so easy because yeah. it's a screw with a little pointy end like a nail you just screw it right in it works really easy it doesn't take much sense. no i know 
know. I'm so impressed. Learn something new all the time. And maybe you could wiggle it around, make a little hole a little bit. There yeah. you go. All right, we're cooking there we now. Go. That was so easy. Gosh, I hope this means that our video is going to be easy. Know, it's too. a good deal. Yeah. All okay. right. So now we're going to take the nail out. The okay. screw out. See, I got a hurt calling in the nail. We too. got a hole there now. So we've got a little bitty hole. Okay. Yep. So now we're going to slather peanut butter. Yeah. Just take. If you guys got some old peanut butter or some really cheap peanut butter or some peanut butter you don't like, yeah, that's what you want to use. I hate this peanut butter that we've got. She doesn't like it. It's kind of nasty. Um, we ended up with a couple of jars of them. I don't know. The peanut butter fairy brought them or something. <laughs> I'm not really sure. So that's what but we're using. It did peanut only took one te teaspoon to let me know that yes. this was this was not for me, and I yes. am a peanut butter person. And you're just going to want to slather so, it on really yes. thick so the bird seed sticks to it. Really thick all over the inside and the edges, too. And I'm not doing very good with this little knife. Now, I kind of like the edge also because the fact that mm -hmm. bird seed falls off a lot, yeah. especially when the birds are pecking on them. I might not put the bird seed on the where they're going to perch right yeah, here. a little tiny edge. But if we put it around there, then when it falls, maybe it will fall and catch on that ledge instead of in my flower bed or in your yeah. flower bed where you know what happens. They germinate and they grow. Yeah. So, oh, that smells good. It does good smell though. good. <laughs> she says it doesn't <laughs> taste good, but it smells good. <laughs> <laughs> So. We gotta go with Peter Pan, or it's just not, just not it. Do y'all like pe peanut butter? What what's, kind of peanut what's butter your do you guys like? Peanut butter. We've got Jeff at my house. Yeah, I don't think this peanut butter probably cost very much. No, it's like an off generic brand. Yeah, yeah. But you know, some of the and it won't really hurt to cover that hole because we're gonna come from the back and stick it on yeah. there. So who cares if it messes if the nail gets peanut through. butter on yeah. it? So yeah, yeah. My um. My daughter Diane will only buy organic peanut butter. Organic, I don't know, and something something else peanut butter. That's all she she buys. But I will eat any kind of peanut butter. So, okay. So the reason that um, the the scripture that we have, yeah, tell them the scripture today, Vonda. You know, you've always heard that song if you were anywhere close to a church or even a TV station that played gospel music mm -hmm. when you were little. You heard the song about his eyes are on the sparrow. Yep. His eyes are on the sparrow, so I know he's watching me. Yeah. So our scripture, uh, I hate to take it because I know you're slathering. That's okay. Is and from I use a green Matthew 10, 29. Please and I'm going to go ahead and add a little bit. I'm gonna get. I'm gonna give you three verses at one time. This is a, this is a discount for you today. <laughs> okay, are not two little sparrows sold for a penny, and yet not one of them will fall to the ground without your father, father's leave and notice. But even the very hairs on your head, all are numbered. Fear not, then. You are more valuable than the sparrows. Yeah. And you know what I forgot to tell you? What's that? To leave a place for this. Oh, yeah. It's okay. Oh, just I can just... Okay, so, so I don't know about y'all, but we have a lot of sparrows around our house. Oh, lots of little birds. Yeah. Lots of sparrows. And they're sparrows more than anything else yeah. until you get big birds move in. And then once the big birds move in, then they kind of run off the little ones. Yeah. But you can always have a sparrow. A sparrow will live in anybody's birdhouse. They are not picky. Um, I have had a speaker on the side of my house, an outdoor mm -hmm. speaker, and I would really like to take it down, but there's always a sparrow living in that, and so I hate to run him off. So, um, you know, you think about that, you think about how many there are, you think about how many people there are on this earth. Oh, yeah. Yet God knows. God knows who you are, where you are, at all times. He, it even says um, in the word that he knows us before we're formed in the womb. Before we're formed. So yeah. we had a life before we got here on this earth. Yeah. 
We just don't know it, but I bet we'll know about it when we get back up there. Yeah, we will. So yeah. when you feel like you're worthless, when you feel like you have no meaning in your life, when you feel like you do not know what God was thinking when he put you on the earth. And I know we all have depression all have at times. Yeah. And we the depression like will that. eat us alive and we'll just have that what if, why, yeah. that feeling. Yeah. Then you just think about those little sparrows and you think God knows about them and he cares about them. He loves them. But it says... You are more valuable than many sparrows. It's in this book. It That's even right. has yellow outline because Paula put it on there. Yes, I did. We are more yeah. valuable than the sparrows. Yeah. He, but he takes care of each and every one of those sparrows and loves them. But he cares more for us than for those sparrows. Yes. And, you know, he loves us so much. Um, I mean, he created us for fellowship with him. And, you know, when you think about that, I mean, that's amazing. Let her talk and let me fix this. Oh, she's going to fix it. Yeah, because I put some in the middle. <laughs> you have to leave it the middle empty. <laughs> See, she always fixes my boobies. <laughs> but, you know, he, I mean, you think about that. God actually created us for fellowship with him. Um, and if you just sit and ponder on that for a while you know that's amazing that he he wants to fellowship with us he he created us for that so if he created us to fellowship with him that means he must love us a lot if he wants to have a relationship with, with right. him you know if he wants he desires that so so when that happens, yeah. pull your book out, That's your right. Bible, right here. That's right. At Matthew 10, 29, 29. through 31. If you're feeling Read down, it. if you're feeling bad, if you feel like things are just all messed up, pull that book out. Read pull it. the Bible out. Because God loves you and so do we. Yep. He so loves you we. so much. Yes. And don't listen to that voice in your head that's telling you that. Listen to God's word and listen to what he's telling you. Yes. How much he loves you. Yes. Yeah. Okay. So now that we've got peanut butter everywhere. Everywhere. Okay. <laughs> but that's okay. I'm going to start out with some red berries and I'm just going to um, kind of, you know, I, I can't just throw things in there. I kind of want yep. them to be kind of uniform. Yeah. I don't so, know why. It's just one of those things. This this thing was actually set up to look kind of like a wreath. Yes. So if you want it to look like a wreath, you can make it uniform circles of the seeds and the Cheerios and um, that kind of stuff. And it will turn out looking like a wreath. And at the same time, so it'll be pretty and decorative. And at the same time, it'll feed the birds. So. And I'm going to do and that too, fun. but we didn't it's have fun. that many berries that were black. Um, because we're still a little early with the berries. Yeah, just a little bit. Yeah. But luckily, we still right. we had some good berries out there. Right. So, we're just going to do rows of these different colored seeds. So, what are we going to do first? What what colors do you want first? Well, next to the berries, maybe mm -hmm. go with a lighter color. Okay. And we can kind of make it um, vary, light and dark, light and dark, maybe. There you go. Yeah. That sounds good. But you guys good. can do it however you want. Yeah. Yeah. Just kind of plan it out in your mind and just right. decide what it is you want to do. Right. And um, there's no right and way, wrong, right and wrong exactly. way. Exactly. It's just how, whatever you want. Yes. And yeah. that's what crafting is. Crafting exactly. is just letting your imagination your go wild. Yeah. Exactly. It's just your preference. So. Oh, man, I thought we were going to run out of room and I'd have to eat that one. Uh-uh. <laughs> She's going to eat some anyway, but we have plenty of room. So. I love berries. Yeah, they're good. I do, too. Okay. Okay. So we've got that we've got stuck on there. Row. Okay, that's yep. our first row. Okay, yep. so what's next? Now I think we ought to throw something 
We got Cheerios. We got yeah. Um, let's throw some Cheerios. Little bitty ones. Let's do some Cheerios. Let's do some Cheerios. Let's do some Cheerios. Right. Yeah. Grab some Cheerios and we'll Oops, do. Sorry, that's we one at you. We got plenty of them. Okay, so we'll the, just the puppy will pick it up and eat it. That's right. Yeah, we, that's what you got a puppy for to eat the stuff that you throw on the floor. <laughs> as long as it's you know, as long as it's okay for. Her. We make sure she doesn't eat anything that's not good Oh, what have you got to get about? You got to do the help thing, huh? That's Just right. let them eat it. <laughs> yeah, my husband would, he lets his dog eat anything. Shorty has, since he was a tiny puppy, has eaten everything my husband eats. <laughs> but I don't think I'm going to let, let my puppy eat Well, and you I can eat. mess up their, what is it? Their pancreas. They can yes. get pancreatitis for that. My mom's yes. dog has pancreatitis. So. Yeah. You do have to be really but, careful, but a Cheerio never hurt anybody. No, no. Shorty, I think, has a stomach, an Unless iron it's stomach. Sweet. There is somebody who can't have Cheerios. Yeah. So, Shorty, I think, has an iron stomach and intestines. Okay. So, we'll now. We'll scooch one more in there, just for good measure. She says, no, you No, I was it smashing up. it down <laughs> so I can pick it up. There, so now we got right. Cheerios. So we got Cheerios. Okay. Yeah. What's next? Now, let's do a dark one. You okay. want to do some of these little tiny things? Yeah, let's go for it. Let's just, yeah. See, now this is where with the little tiny ones, we're just going to have to, I think, scoop them with a spoon. A funnel would have been a good oh, idea. Oh, a funnel would have been a great but, idea. Yeah, I don't do think we, we have, have a funnel that I can put my hands on right now. That would have been a great idea. idea. But this is the first time we've done it. That's right. So we're Be just going to Be patient wing it. with us. We're going to wing it. Um... I'm thinking, I'm thinking, I'm thinking of funnels. And in funnels. the meantime, I'm just... What if we did a funnel? She's going to make a funnel. Oh, <laughs> what a great idea. Hey, funnel here. And she says, hold your horses, Paul. Oh, but you're looking pretty good there without the funnel. Not too bad. I'm just taking a few in my fingers at one time, and it's not going to be a perfect round circle, but... That looks... Forget the funnel. That looks just as good. But I would try a funnel if you had one. A funnel would work perfect. Yeah. Because you could fill the funnel and go around in a circle. And yeah. that would be perfect. That would be good. So, yeah. And so when she gets down there, we're going to smush it down in the peanut butter a little yeah. bit. And you really could add a lot once you get it smushed down in mm -hmm. there. You could add more. Yeah. yeah. A lot more. Because we have a lot of seeds. We, we have a lot of seeds here. And you know, the squirrels are going to be happy with it, too. Oh, yeah. Even the squirrel friends can yeah. eat some of this. But the, there, we didn't find a scripture about squirrels. No. <laughs> so it's, and, it, and it is a bird. A, it, it's a, a bird it's seed. It's a sparrow thing. Yeah, so. it is a, a bird seed. Breed. That's right. So, yeah. And I think I'll go around one more time with this because I did, I did pretty sparingly the first time. So. Well, we got sparingly, some. Sparingly. Oh, listen to you. Yeah. Pun intended. I had to get that in there. Actually, I didn't, I didn't have that. It just popped out. That was the Holy Spirit. <laughs> That's the Holy Spirit with his sense of humor. You know, God does have a sense of humor. Yeah, look at the platypus. That's right. Oh, I got peanut butter everywhere on me now. That's okay. So I'm just squishing it down. Yep, I'm she's going along behind, behind you. And she's squishing, squishing it, down. it down. Yeah. I think if you were in the third grade. You'd have so much fun with this. Yeah. You know, this would be great for um, uh, Brownies, Girl Scout Project, Boy Scout Project. Mm -hmm. um, Church group project. I think this would be awesome. Kids, this is a perfect kid project. Any kind of conservation, yeah. help the nature type exactly. thing. It would be exactly. great for it. Yeah. Boy, okay. we've got a lot more than what we've got room for here. Yeah. Um, that's okay. Well, we're going to do some on the sides, too. That's true. Yeah, we've got room on the sides, too. So, okay. Now, let's go with the light one again. Okay. Yeah. Well, we've got these little tiny things that Listen. nobody has told us. Tell us what these I know. are. Somebody tell us what these <laughs> tiny. They're little. Can you guys see that? They're little. Tiny. Anytime you get bird seed. Hey, it's... Doris, how are you? Hey. Thanks for watching. Can you tell us what these are, Doris? <laughs> it's some you... kind of bird seed. Okay. If you get, if you have a parakeet, there's some people put like oh. peanut butter on a stick. Yeah. And stick those all over. Is that what they give the parakeets? Is those things? Okay. Yeah. Okay. I think we need to. Did I blob too much off? Yeah, we need more right there. And I'm not doing very good getting it back on there. So, I'll... Here, I'll do it with my finger. You sure? <laughs> okay, she's just going to do it with I'm her always, finger. Okay, now squish it off with my finger. Squish oh. it off with my finger. There you go. Okay. Now. Okay. Okay, so there there's no messing this up. <laughs> oh, that's the nasty stuff. See, I, 
I didn't want to do that because you said it was nasty peanut. She said it's it was nasty It's really, it's butter. not bad, but it's not yeah. Peter Pan. Or Jif. Or, or Jif, that's right. Okay, so now I'm going to do the little light ones. They're tiny, tiny, tiny. They are tiny. Yeah, but they're cute. Cute little seeds. They're pretty. And I love to give dogs to, uh, peanut butter, too. They love peanut oh. butter. So I have a story on my sister, Gina. Gina, if you're watching, or if you're going to watch it on, don't forget, hashtag replay, if you watch this later. Yes, please let us know you watch. Yeah, watched. so my sister, Gina, Gina Storm Dahlberg. Okay, so when she was little, we had a oh, best dog ever. His name was Butch, and he was such a good dog. Um, Put a bunch right here. She would get a jar of peanut butter and she'd get a spoon and she'd sit on the porch and she'd take a lick and then she'd hand him a lick with that spoon. Oh, my daughter did and that She'd do too. a lick and then she'd give him a lick. <sighs> oh yeah, and she did that all the time. <laughs> okay, well we've just about got it. Now, what if we outline some blackbird seed in the middle? Yeah. Wait, how's our, how big is our sign? Nope, we're not oh, going to have enough room. Nope. Okay. I think we should do it around the outside. Go for it. The edge. Okay. Yeah. But we don't have peanut butter all the way on the edge, so I'm going to have to... I didn't do it. Well, we were going to kind of leave some so that it didn't... So the birds could step on it. Well, I thought they'd sit right here. Oh, okay. Yeah. Because birds got tiny, 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 tiny little feet. So they can go on that little edge. But we're, do, we're not doing the very outer edge. We're doing the inside edge. So, so they can pick... Pick stuff off that, and I'm messy. I know I am. Doesn't but, matter. It does not matter how messy you are. Birds don't care how messy you as are. As long as you pick up after yourself. That's right. Don't leave your dirty clothes on the floor. <laughs> pick your dishes up. Full hands in, full hands out. That's that's important. Full hands in, full hands out. Yeah, you learn that when you work in a restaurant. Oh. So you know you carry your full your your dishes. You know the. Um, meals for people at, mm -hmm. in, give it to them, you serve them. On your way back out, if you see oh. dirty dishes on someone's table, oh. you just, it doesn't matter if it's your table or not, you grab those dirty dishes. Gotcha. So, okay. you know, that's a hard habit to break. So, but it's a good habit because when you're at home, you see dirty clothes, dirty dishes, you grab them and you go. Yeah. I teach my grandkids that. I don't know about sticking these things right here. We probably should have done that first if I. Oh, yeah. Well, what if we do it like this? What if we hold it? Oh, yeah, that's not working that's either. That's how that's going to happen. <laughs> we should probably done the sides first. But we can still. These are um, the sunflower seeds, so we're just sticking them on the side. I think I think the little birdies will appreciate the sunflower seeds. We have a lot of cardinals, yeah. and so oh, I'm oh. just I'm just putting oh, them in there random. willy nilly. Oh, and see, being I'm nice being all neat. nice and neat. I'm sticking mine upside down, like lengthwise. Oh well, see, my birds are just gonna <laughs> then my birds are just gonna eat it. It doesn't care. And then I thought I could take the pumpkin seeds. Oh, you're so much better than me. No, because <laughs> no, I, oh, no. I can't see where it is. Look at this. She's doing this simple little line, and I'm just sticking them on here. That's all right. That's okay. I'm just thinking of thinking of the birds, <laughs> so they have more more food. They're nice to eat. and neat birds, and mine are <laughs> mine are messy birds. <laughs> I'm just thinking of getting more food in them. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, the pumpkin seeds are bigger. We probably should put some, in, put them in there, because they're really big. And don't okay. forget, if you like this video, don't forget to sprinkle with your friends and family, and that keeps us in the loop with Facebook and our other social media and platforms. And if you like all of our crafts, be yes. sure and follow us and hit yes. that bell so that you'll get notifications yes. that we're on. We have really got a lot planned. Um, yes, we do. So we don't want you to miss anything. That's Not right. anything at all. That's and we know it's backwards and we can't figure it out. You know, from Friday to Monday, something happened. <laughs> we, something changed. And we can't figure out how to get us back on our videos to where everything is not mirrored. If so, you're a Facebook wizard, tell us where the button please is. Please help. It's <laughs> always been so easy. Friday it was fine. We knew the buttons to push. 
today we did it and the button was gone. <laughs> so um, we like change. We try to adapt to change. So, well, no, I won't say we like change. Okay, we try to adapt to change. <laughs> but um, it just, yeah, the button was gone. It blew our hairy little minds. That's yes, the it truth. Did. <laughs> and, and, and it made it made us um, slow down. It made us not be able to do what we planned on doing. Right. It made us late doing our the morning video. Stinking little button we could not find it. Used to yeah. you could hit the little one, and then there was another little deal you hit, mm -hmm. and then it come up with look like a little book. Right. We tried that. It was gone. <clears throat> did not work. So there were some changes made and we're okay with change if you tell us. Just tell us what's going just on. Just tell us so we know how okay. to do Can it. Can we turn this? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. And I'll just keep putting little black seeds on here and y'all, you, um, I think I've held this up long enough. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, if you like our crafts, um, if you like our scripture and you like what we're doing then give us some hearts some likes hashtag that. replay and yeah if you watch us on the replay please in the comments if you have questions um, just ask us in the comments and if we know the answer we'll tell you if we don't we'll look it up and we'll try to and if you know answer. the answer to what these little bitty beans these little seeds are called oh yeah the little pearl seeds please let us know yeah that would be great okay so we want just, um, we want the decorations, but we also want a reminder of why we're doing this. Right. right. So what I want to do is do, pick this up, pick this up. See, we, on cardstock, mm -hmm. that's all I did is printed right. it off on cardstock. Right. Made me a little circle. I yes. found several little blocks, and I'm just going to glue the little blocks together. Right. Just so that it sticks out. Um, from the middle of the well, that's hard, bird seed. This is not going. Uh oh. From the middle of the bird seed wreath, because we want to make sure that every craft that we do that it it honors God and that it gives Him the glory. Because um, if it weren't for Him, we wouldn't be here doing this, um, and we're doing this for Him. But I don't know why we're not getting glue out of here. Uh oh. I know. It's hot. Maybe it's not hot enough. We'll let it sit a little bit longer. Okay. I'll keep, I'll keep putting more bird seed on here. Yeah, we, um, we um, want to be intentional about what we're doing um, to make sure that it always glorifies God and that um, we shine a light for Him and that we spread His Word and get His Word out. So... Okay, there. so what we're going to do is we're going to take these little blocks. Yes. We're going to glue them together. Glue them right here on top of this. In the okay? middle. Mm -hmm. And then we're going to take this. Probably would it be a good idea if you have some transfer paper. Mm -hmm. We can put a little bit on top of it. Maybe right. it'll keep the rain from killing to it. To protect it from the She'll weather. She'll hand me those scissors. We're going yep. to do that. Are you through? I can keep going. <laughs> Do we have more pumpkin? Oh yeah, we have more pumpkin seeds. They, these are nice because they're bigger and they can fill in those little holes that you have here and there and just cover up more of that peanut butter. You know, we don't do anything at our home on Sunday. We, we use that for rest. Yeah. But this would be fun to do with the grandkids when they're over. Yeah. We could do this could be a, a this is not really a work. This is a no. play. Yeah. So we could do that. That and would be fun. You could talk to the kids, to the grandkids about God's word too. There's so many ways that you can introduce yeah. the kids to to the Lord. Yeah. And to his word. And I'm just going to cut little slits. I've gotten bird seed on there. That one we don't know what it's called. <laughs> um, I'm just going to cut some slits on here so that it will lay easy. We're just going to fold it over. It's not going to be pretty. It's not going to be exact. But That's we okay. don't care. The birds don't care. Right. As long as it's um, that way, it's protected from the weather. That's right. And if the yeah. birds don't care, we don't care. That's right. So we're just folding it over. Yeah. We're just folding over on top like this. So we have this 
it is clean, it is safe, it will not mess up. And we're gonna hot glue right here on the top. In the middle, so it sticks out, a little 3D there. And I hope y'all can see. Yes, it gives a little 3D and the yeah. little birds can peck around there all they want. Yeah. And we'll take a picture of it later and y'all can yep. see. Yeah. We thank you so much thank for joining you. us today. We yes. just have such a good time just sitting down with y'all yeah. and talking and and be sure and, and just give us some comments and let us know what's yeah. up with you because we miss everybody so much. And um, we just also... Yep. Oh, Doris says she can't tell what they are. Thank you, Doris. Thanks. We so appreciate that you like it. We so appreciate you watching. Yes, thank you. Thank you. We love y'all yeah. so much. And we yeah. just hope to see y'all again later. Thank you. But in the meanwhile, remember... Love one another. Love one another. Bye. Bye.